mean, any, anyone that's actually seen you without a shirt, if you're, you know, you look like an anatomy chart. There's zero body fat on you. You got, you know, um, it, it, it just is amazing when people achieve that level. And I would like you just to briefly share a little bit about like, your personal stance on your nutritional take. Well, uh, I'm a... I'm an avid proponent of uh, paleolithic diet and uh, eating, uh, eating as our ancestors uh, uh, have eaten for many, many thousands of years. And I believe this, uh, this is what I have found to be the best approach. Uh, of course, there is a certain uh, um, modifications that can be made for certain individuals a higher, a bit of a higher protein, avoiding uh, this and that, and, and upping the, the carbohydrate consumption. And you, there is also a place for post-workout nutrition and sports supplements if you're very serious about your training. And, uh, but mainly, uh, if it, like, like Charles Poliquin says, if, if it ran in the, uh, in the field, if it flies in the sky, if it swims in the water or it grows out of the ground and green, you can eat it. And this is a very basic and very straightforward approach and uh, this is the way that I've been eating for more than 10 years. And uh, uh, low protein, uh, low carbohydrate, lower uh, uh, carbohydrate consumption and, problem and problems in your training. I never encountered that, and uh, uh, not enough of that, and imbalances due to this uh, uh, imbalanced approach. I don't know what, what people are talking about. Anyone that has been doing uh, this kind of approach under my guidance in my, con in my clinic in Israel, and uh, my friends, my students, anyone that was serious about it only saw great results and felt great. But sometimes, you know, the, the general public uh, creates some kind of a panic around something. And this is the time to use your logic and your uh, self-awareness to certain things. And paleo paleolithic diet is one of them. It's just a, a, a logic you cannot win against. You know, if you believe in evolution, if you, you believe in the development of, uh, of the human race, you should eat like that. a day, sometimes uh, going to, to my anaerobic threshold and pushing and doing strength endurance and, uh, and, and power work and strength and static and dynamic and technical elements and have to be sharp in my mind the whole time and doing uh, uh, capoeira work and artistic work and I've, I've always felt that it fulfilled any need that I have nutrition. Is there any lasting message that you would want your your students or people that are intrigued to, to get to know you better that you'd want them to know about you? Well, uh, I would want people to know that uh, it is not a, it is not a, a rare phenomenon or a, a, a very talented individual that reached. Uh, kind of a, a, this kind of work, this kind of practice, this kind of movements, it is possible to do it, it's just a, a lot of hard, I have nothing special and I don't like to get also attached to, to my knowledge and to, to feel as if my knowledge is me, I am not the sum of my knowledge and I, I'm happy to share my knowledge to people and to, like I say all the time, to spill it on the ground and if they are uh, willing to pick it up and to take it with them, that will be great. Sometimes the knowledge is, is uh, left on the ground, and that is also okay. It will uh, drip down through the cracks in the floor and disappear, um, but maybe something will grow out of it anyway. So I think that that's about it. Well, I've had Ido here at the shop now for two days, and in coaching for
have been around several people who I would consider masters, and you uh, you definitely stand alone in your own art and your own craft, and you you are a master that belongs uh, here to stay. So it was a privilege to have you in Spokane, and uh, we really hope that you uh, you come back. But uh, uh, this is going to spread like wildfire, my friend. You're gonna you're gonna be in high demand. So. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. It has a lot of memory, huh? <laughs>